Let's spawn a dodo in. Let's get a dodo. Here's a dodo. Holy shit, what the- Hey you guys, what's up? So today we are in Ark and we are checking out a couple of the steampunk mods and we're gonna be checking out the Indominus Rex too because apparently someone else is doing stuff with that or some something's going on with that mod. I don't know exactly what's going on, but I think they said something about an extra, a, a greenish tint to the skin or something. We'll, we'll get into that later. Here is the hop air balloon that is in the steampunk mod. That's something that was actually like recently added into the game um, not too long ago. Then we have these auto turrets, which these guys are pretty cool. I tried them out a little bit earlier and and uh, they have a hell of a knockback. Actually, in my modded survival let's play, I'm probably going to use these because these things are actually pretty cool. And uh, by the way, I'm wearing the steampunk armor. Uh, this stuff's supposed to be released pretty soon um, from what I've seen in the patch notes. I'll show it to you on the male model too. Um, it, I mean, what kind of vibe do you guys get from this? To me, it's kind of like um, Borderlands and uh, Bioshock. That's the feel I get from this. And uh, a little bit of Fallout. Obviously, a little bit of Fallout. But you guys let me know what you think uh, what you think this armor is inspired by or if it's being if he's being completely uh, completely original with it like I said I'll show you guys I'll show you I'll show you it on the uh, on the male model um, oh, that's the that's just the app in box I don't oh, shit, I don't want that going okay there we go um, we're gonna check out this hot air balloon because this thing actually looked pretty cool we just let me just try and spawn a dire wolf, a dire wolf earlier and it just like completely messed with it come, come here I gotta fly are you serious I gotta I gotta type in admin commands gross all right, so this is the hot air balloon. This thing's moving really freaking fast. It should not be moving this fast. I wish you could like mount turrets onto this thing. That'd be so cool. We got, hmm, can you, I wonder, you, you could shoot from it, obviously. You, sh you should be able to, oh wow, it still moves even with you in it. That's a little bit sketchy. How do I, what do you do if, oh, oh God, I almost walked off the edge. Oh God, that would have, that would have been really bad. Uh, let me just see. Let's take this bad boy out for a little bit. Let's let's see what we can find out around here. Thing I don't get about this is that it's made of freaking copper. Like you can see the balloon is copper. Like it's I don't I don't know about you, but I don't think copper is really that uh that susceptible to not being affected by gravity like I'm pretty sure you can't just fill a, a copper hot air balloon with hot air and it'll fly. I think it's pretty yeah, it's pretty much the opposite. It'll probably make the balloon really hot and uh, you'll probably fall to the ground like a rock, like, you know, physics would say you should. I wonder if we can take this thing underwater. Can you just imagine though being Oh god, oh god, oh god. I got to I got to not do that cuz moving in this thing and getting off is a little bit sketchy cuz it doesn't stop right away. Can you just imagine being hide, hiding out in one of these things? You peek up, pe you, you peek up like that, there we go, and you start sniping someone. Wouldn't that be so cool? That'd be amazing. This thing has like a thousand health, I think, or something too. So, I mean, it could take, I think it could take a beating, a little bit of a beating at least, unless you got an ascended, R uh, ascended RG or RPG. Wow, if I could talk to that, I'd be really happy. Let's put these fin things on, on the back. That must be like what blows it forward. They look like two little wind windmill fans. Huh. What happens if we take this into the water? Are we gonna be like stuck here forever if we if we go into the water? Let me just see. Uh, don't want to go down too far. All right, let's let's see if we can make this thing into a submarine. Oh god. Oh, it didn't do anything. What? Are you serious? It doesn't stall it out. It doesn't do anything to it. No, really? What kind of shit is that? I'm gonna go right underwater with this thing. Screw it. Who cares? That's a megalodon. Oh wow, we're we're right in the water with this thing. Holy shit, that's a little bit derpy. I mean, it's still moving. Oh, it has health and stuff too in the top right, so the oxygen and all that stuff, huh? I mean, regardless, ju just because it's a copper thing floating, I mean, like, you think you think it wouldn't even go underwater with that much air in it either way? I mean, it would have a lot of buoyancy. I like the sound effect it has at least. I have a I have an RPG spawned in now too, so I'm gonna go ahead. I'm just gonna stop this thing, load it up real quick. There we go. Give me that. Those gloves look pretty good. I, wow, I actually like this armor a lot. I'm definitely gonna incorporate some of the steampunk thing into my survival series. Hell yeah, that looks cool as hell. We got like the Jurassic Park theme going on. I still haven't tested. I got I gotta test out those auto turtles a little bit more too, because those are gonna be cool. Okay, so there's an unsuspecting Sarko right here. Hey little, that's that's what the. What? Why am I inside the engine? I'm actually in- This is what I mean by it's really sketchy. Let's just- Let's just not- we're gonna, we're gonna act like that didn't happen, okay? Boom. Oh shit. What the- What the- What? Okay, so maybe you gotta stand- Maybe you should just stand on the edge. Maybe you should just jump. There we go. Boom. And you're dead. We're gonna, we're gonna act like none of that stuff happened. We didn't fall into the engine of the thing. We didn't shoot ourselves with the uh with the invisible wall we're just gonna act like none of that happened i wonder what what a t-rex oh wow we actually did damage to it how much damage did it take we can't see the health 
No, we can't see the health. All we can see is that it took damage in the top right. Wow. Okay. All right. Well, yeah, I'm not even going to argue with it. It's okay. What happens if we... Can we, like... What happens if we fly into this? Will it do damage to it? I think that'd be kind of cool. No? No damage? Huh. I figured that'd be something. I figured that would be a thing. Of all things, I figured that would be a thing. I wonder what a Titan would do to this. Wow, okay, a Titan would probably ruin this thing, actually. I think this thing has a, a maximum carry weight, too, so, like, if you're too heavy, it's just not gonna fly. Oh, unsuspecting victim. Oh, sh what the f What the hell, man? What kind of bullshit is that? How the hell do we get back to... <laughs> like, that's the biggest flaw. Like, wait, can you call it down? We can't... We can't call it down. That's... That's a problem. So definitely don't fall. Well, if you have a jetpack, I mean you're okay. But don't fall out of this thing if you guys use this mod because wow, you're not you're not getting back into it. It's just not gonna happen. All right, come here, come here, Mr. Diplo. Oh, you go. Stop moving! Damn it! Damn you! Stop it! Stop! Stop! Be good. Be good. I I will shoot you. Yeah, you didn't like that, did you? No, you didn't. I didn't like doing it. it almost hurt me as much as it hurt you. Except I have God mode, so I'm okay. That guy's dead. All right, sweet. I'm gonna go to the sky a little bit. I mean, at least uh, you look like a badass in this thing, though. I, I will admit that. I don't know how to feel about the whole giant hunky thing on the back. Wouldn't that make it, like, really heavy on the back and put it off balance? I feel like that would do that. And the steam's not even going inside the hot air balloon. Hot air balloons I have in mind, the steam is like it goes up into the middle of the balloon, and then that's basically all it's set. Like, that's all that's done with it. This thing kind of just has an engine on the back that blows air back, and the balloon, I assume, somehow, some way, shape, or form, is inflating itself on the inside, which, that doesn't make any sense. So you do look like a badass with this armor on while you're flying around in it, I will give it that. Except you're kind of like, your arms are spread out, you're puffing your chest up, you're just like, huh, I'm a badass, yeah. I'm badass of the sky, I'm the sky, I'm the sky commander, yeah. You kind of look like you're looking for a fight, actually, holy shit, look at that. It actually looks like you're looking for a fight. I don't know how to feel about that. Oh well. Anyways, we're gonna head back to our little, uh, our little battle arena thing and, uh, definitely check out the Indominus Rex and we're gonna spawn in a bunch of stuff for those turrets to handle too and we're gonna check those out a little bit. Uh, here we are. Home sweet home. There we go. I'm definitely, man, guaranteed I'm going to do some of the steampunk stuff in my, uh, in my let's play. Like, it's gonna happen. What happens if we destroy this thing? Let's just destroy it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> This is why we can't have good things, people. We gotta destroy them to see what happens. How much health do you have? Okay, okay, next rocket's gonna kill it. Next rocket's gonna kill it. If it just falls into, like, little metal chunks, I'm gonna be kind of disappointed. It didn't even do that! I would have been more disappointed if it did this, and it did this! What the hell, man? I can access your inventory, you don't have anything there. Okay, I'm kinda- I'm kinda disappointed at that. Wow. Alright, I- I was- I'm more so disappointed that it didn't do anything. All right, whatever, I guess. I, I'm not... I'm not gonna complain too much. I don't want to be a negative Nancy about it. Oh, this is the armor. Uh, this is the steampunk armor, but obviously you can't really see uh, what it looks like. Uh, copper chest piece. Uh, yeah, that's basically it. Like, it, I'm not sure how long it's gonna take them to get that done, but I hope it's soon because that armor looks really freaking cool. Let's just go ahead. We're gonna, we're gonna spawn some stuff in for our friendly little turrets. Let's see, they're powered. Uh, do we have ammo in them? Okay, all right. They have uh, advanced impulse ammo, high caliber modern missile, primarily used with steam turrets. All right, so these guys are all locked and loaded. Yeah, you are locked and loaded. All right, we're gonna go ahead. We'll spawn. Let's spawn a dodo in. Let's get a dodo. Here's a dodo. Holy shit! What the? Okay. All right. Yeah. <laughs> That sucker got launched. Dude, that that guy got launched. Oh my god. Let's spawn on let's spawn on a bunch of dodos then. Damn. That guy that guy got like he didn't even stand a freaking chance. Oh yeah, it's going to go down. It's going to go down. <laughs> oh god. Is it just like sending a hot Oh my god. Is it just sending like a very very harsh like um, projectile at them, like it's going so fast we can't see it, or like is it just blowing air at them at like terminal velocity or some shit? Alright, we're gonna play the arc equivalent to bowling. We have a hundred dodos and we have a bunch of our little steam cannons all set up. They're gonna blow hot air at these guys and make them fly around, I assume. With this many steam cannons, I'd say they'll be dealt with pretty fast. Boom. <laughs> that one guy. Man, you gotta get lost. He's like right in his face, dude. It's gonna take your head off. Oh god, rip in peace. Rip in peace. Rip in... <laughs> Shoot! Fire! Oh god, what the... <laughs> he disappeared! 
<laughs> oh god, I don't think these Holy shit, that guy went <laughs> One just got launched into the air and then hit by another turret. That is so amazing. Um, I don't think the steam cannons do any damage. Just from what I'm seeing here, because they're not killing the dodos, but they are knocking them back like crazy. So, I mean, I think it's a sufficient non-lethal base defense. Which, oh wow, that guy, look, that looks cool. I didn't, I didn't notice it arcs up and it starts, like, powering up. Alright, I figured it was time we do something more sizable, more threatening. So, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna spawn in a Tyrannosaurus Rex. That's what we're gonna do. Just spawn in one single Rex. We're gonna see if this cannon can blow it back or not. I really hope that they can, uh, they can blow it back. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. So much, so much. No, it looks like the, uh, the Rex is too big. Wow, they are really... Why are they shooting so much now? It looks like the Rex can't be knocked back. Man, they are they are viciously assaulting that thing. <laughs> Look at that. It sounds like an AA battery. They've got some range. Damn. The Rex doesn't even want to do anything with that. Holy shit. All right. They can push back dire bears. That's for sure. Damn. Dire bears like, nope. Don't want anything to do with that. Too bad it can hit you too, though. Like, that's the worst of it. I know normal auto turrets don't normally... They, like, they don't actually hit you. Let's let's just reload these guys a little bit because it seems like they're uh, they're running low on the uh, on the ammo. All right, time to try them on a giga. Try time to try them on a giga. If they start attacking, like if it starts doing damage to the turrets, though, I'm just gonna stop it and I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to the Indominus because uh, I don't want the giga to destroy everything. There we go. Oh shit, it's pissed. Ah, what the? Yeah, they're not doing anything to it. It's too big. It's too fat. It's too heavy. It's too everything. Why do they go right for the hot air balloon? Like, do you like do you like eating copper? I think it sucks that this these things can't actually do anything to the to the larger dinosaurs. I think that kind of sucks. Let's just players only that. Damn, that's a lot of smoke. Whew. Um, I think it sucks because did they even do any damage to one? Can you not? Let's see what damage it did. Did it do any damage? No. Okay, so it didn't do any damage to them at all, pretty much. Um, yeah. All right, let's get the Indominus in here. What the? F what the hell did they do to it, dude? They. They butchered this. Like, you can still see some of the white skin trying to show through. The spines don't even... What the hell did they do to it? This is ridiculous. It looks like a freaking mint dinosaur. Like, this is the color of ice cream you get when you get mint ice cream. If you guys have ever had soft serve, it's what, it's, this is what mint soft serve looks like. And why is its ankle so screwed up now? What did it, did it, did the guy, like, abuse it and, and break its ankle? Like, seriously, what, what, what's going on with this thing? Why would, this is what I don't understand. We had a perfectly good Indominus Rex mod. Someone decided to try and fix what wasn't broken. And in the process, they made it look baby shit green. Like, is that necessary? Is that really necessary? I'm in contact with the primary developer for the Indominus Rex. And if you guys want, leave a comment below and I will get in contact with him and see if he will revert the Indominus Rex to what it was. Because this broken ankle, minty green baby shit looking green teeth, green teeth! You couldn't even take the time out of your day to make sure the teeth were white. That's ridiculous. Anyways, uh, leave a comment below if you want me to contact the mod developer, and I'll see if I can get that fixed up. Um, if not, well, I guess we'll just, we'll, we'll, we'll leave it as a memory of the past. That's it. Um, let's see what the auto turrets do to it. I hope it didn't screw up anything else with it. Um, but yeah, let's, let's see what the auto turrets think of this thing, because, uh, yeah. Okay, so they're hitting it at, it can't even free, it's hobbling, it's, it was hobbling. But it looks like it's too heavy for the uh, steam turrets to do anything to it. They look so cool though when they fight. Like, look at that. They, they look so freaking cool. I like how it charges up the cannon. It's just like, ah, look at that. All right, so we're on the Indominus because it's clear that the uh, the turrets aren't going to do anything to it. Um, let's just see what else was messed up with this thing. Uh, nothing. The foot's still a little bit wonky. It can't run. I can tell you that much right now. I'm trying to run and its foot is just like derping the hell out. It looks like the run animation is actually a little bit messed up because its foot's going under the ground now. 
Oh, look, it actually does the uh, jaw animation now when you want it to roar. Nice. I don't like the green, though. I, I definitely don't like that green. This, this greenish tint. I don't know what the hell the point of this was. God, I feel so bad for him. I feel so bad for him. He was such a good... It was such a good mod. It was such a good mod. Oh, my God. God, I, I hope it's fixed. I really hope it's fixed. I'm not liking the, the whole broken ankle thing. God, it looks like it's been abused. It looks like some... It's like a new owner took it and just started abusing the shit out of it. Oh, God. What's your health? 12,800 health tamed. I don't remember you having 12,800 health tamed. I remember you having like 60,000 health or something. This guy used to be wicked strong. I guess he got nerfed a little bit. I'm not, I'm not going to complain about nerfs. I won't complain about nerfs. That's, that's a gameplay thing. That's not something that's game breaking for the Indominus. Because I'm sure no matter what, it's still going to be a beast. <laughs> it looks like it's going to try and wave goodbye to us. <laughs> so apparently I won't be showing you what it looks like on the male model because it makes you almost completely and totally invisible. So yeah, that's basically it. And it looks like the headpiece is still for the female. So I guess it's only working right now for the female model. And they're probably working on the male model thing, hoobity waddy stuff. Uh, and yeah, I had to give up everything I had in order to, uh, in order to show you that. So, I'm a ghost. Hell yeah. But, I'm gonna end that video right there. I hope you guys, <laughs> God, the Indominus. Oh, God, I'm, uh, I'm not, ha I'm not happy with that. <laughs> what the f- <laughs> I have no hands. Oh my God. <laughs> oh God. Oh God. Anyways, I'm gonna try and do that in or that outro out again. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you smash the crap out of that like button. We might actually fix the Indominus an Indominus's ankle by doing that. You poor little guy, please don't eat me. <laughs> and I will see you in the next video.